I want to salute you, homie, you know, for, for building your own thing and doing your own thing, creating your own platform, your own website. I got one life to live out my dreams, and I'm giving this thing all I got. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I represent the culture. All right now, you're turning up on MrTalaferro.com, shawty. Yeah. All right, Alfred Telefero, Mr. Telefero TV. I'm out here looking for revenge. All summer 16. And that's what Drake did. I think he did a pretty good job of it. He got revenge all summer 16. Nobody likes when their phone is violated, though, right? Drake got his phone violated, man. When you got those private text conversations, well, in your mind, when you text somebody, you, you want it to be private, all right? If I wanted to tell the public, I would have just posted it on my social media account. I got like 30 million Instagram followers. This is me if I'm Drake. If I wanted to tell everybody a conversation me and you are having, I just would have told everybody. Ian Connor released a text message that he and Drake had where Drake detailed his revenge plan. And just like behind, like what does revenge mean for Drake? And this is what Drake told Ian Connor. Trust, bro. The blissful times of being new and exciting and non-threatening are over. There is real people suffering through issues based on around their own misery and frustrations and their reaction to it all is being taken out on those that threaten their bubble. Anyone that disrupts the feeling of the world revolving around them. Kobe ended his career with an entire campaign about how much people hate him. What a way to have to exit, to feel like that I was too good, that even in my farewell we have to address the years you sp spent hating me for it. Just don't let it make you better. Please, I am happy despite waking up every day and someone new flipping on me or talking down. And I have grown to the point that I re that revenge makes me happy because my revenge isn't malicious. It's warranted. So what is Drake saying? I'm cool with everybody dissing me every day. Whether it's Meek Mill making a, a record about me or getting on Twitter and talking about me after I did a record with him on his album. Whether it's, man, who everybody is coming at Drake. Whether it's um Kanye West. Whether it's whoever it is. Kid Cudi. It's so, been so many people come at Drake. What is it? Push a T. It's been so many people that just say Drake this, Drake that. Drake has almost become a common question in an interview. In an interview, are you going to work with Drake? What do you think about working with Drake? You know what I'm saying? I've just seen it the weekend do an interview and they asked him about Drake. Drake has become so big and so polarizing. It's a common thing. He's almost like a thing and not a person anymore. You going to work with Drake? You going to work with the Drake? You know what I'm saying? That's how it feels with him. And with all that talking. It's bound for somebody to say something negative about you because everybody's being asked about you. You're the most popping thing from a hip-hop and pop standpoint right now. So Drake's like, man, I'm cool. Just keep bringing my name up in a malicious way, and I'm going to let these records do the talking. I'm going to let these tours and these numbers do the talking, and I'm going to get you back, but I ain't going to get on Twitter or Instagram and talk about you. I'm going to put you in that music. That way, not only do I talk about you, when I drop a, sing, a song, it's usually a hit record. So not only do you, you got to know to deal with the fact that I got you back, you got to hear this record for months at a time. Uh, Meek Mill had to hear back to back for a while. It was Grammy nominated last year. That's how Drake gets his revenge. Any detail that plan. And from Ian Connor's standpoint, bro, is it really... That cool to say you're texting Drake. I mean, okay, bro. He, whatever. He the best in music right now from a hip-hop side. Or we consider him the number one guy. A lot of us do. But, bro, you look so corny posting a text message. If somebody posts a text message to me and I gave you the time of day to even communicate with you, if we're just cordially friends, that'll be the last text message you post. So you better cherish it. If I see that message on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, that's it for you, buddy. That you might as well cherish it, cause you, you and everybody else. That's the last time you gonna see that damn text come from me, and be the last time we communicate. At no point in my life do I feel as if though my text message should be posted. We're texting for a damn reason. I go by the name of Fit Telefell. You're coming to the Miss Telefell TV. What do you think about Drake's revenge plan? And what do you think about Ian Connor? Pretty much 
detailing this plan to the public. Thank you for the time, love and support, salute. I'm out. Hey, first and foremost, I wanna thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I would love if you watch other videos while you're on my YouTube channel. Now, while you're here, people ask me all the time, how can you support Mr. Telefero? Well, if you wanna support me in my future endeavors, the first thing I want you to do is subscribe to my channel. If you subscribe to my channel, you get all my content first. Your subscribe goes a long way. I get to understand my demographics, understand who support me, who got something out this video. So first things first, a subscribe will go a long way. Next, if you really rock with me, donate a dollar to my GoFundMe. I have a GoFundMe link in the description. If you really want to support me, just a dollar. Showing me that a dollar and some good wishes will go a long way. If you want to support me and you want to help me with my travels, I got a lot of things coming up, but I got to get them travel fees there. I got to find a way to get there. So that can help me financially if you really want to go there. Also, a word of encouragement. Thank you. Whatever it is, talk to me in my comment box below. Comment on this video. Like, subscribe, do whatever you got to do this video. I got to thank you for your time. I don't take it for granted. My name is Mr. Telefero. Now, if you subscribe, help, donate, do whatever, you can see more videos like this, more new exclusive content. I got a lot on the way. Trust me. Thank you. It's Mr. Telefero.com.